Hi, I'm Eileen Boxler, and I'm the Fall 2024 Arts Walk. <laughs> fall 2024 Arts Walk cover artist. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm I, I'm inspired by nature. You know, whether it's the glistening of a spider web with the dew on it in the morning, or it's seeing the sunlight through the leaves. So those kind of things inspire me, and, and it's not so much the visual. I like to paint more of an abstraction, so it's really the feel that I want my paints and the, the choice that I make with the, the mixed medium that I add to it. The way encaustic works, it really allowed me to kind of push the envelope. Well, the beauty of it is it's so versatile. I can include a lot of those medium that I used and am used to working with in my encaustic painting. So I can do ink in my encaustic work or watercolor or things like that. I gather tree stumps. My daughter thinks I'm crazy, but, but yeah, trees that we've lost due to drought or disease. And so then I take the stumps and I process them to make prints. And then I put the prints in wax. I mean, I'm very concerned about the environment. And so I feel I really want to capture that beauty. I think what we find beautiful and important, we want to take care of. This is my cover art painting. It's, again, it's encaustic and mixed media. It's called Forest Awakening. When I was commissioned to create the painting, the idea came pretty quickly to mind. I just had that vision of um, that feeling that I get when I walk in the morning with the fog and it's cool. I create the ferns through, an, uh, through stencils that I make. And so a lot of times some of them were real ferns to begin with. I love creating paintings that feel like you wanna reach in and touch the painting. With the manipulating of, of the hot and cold wax, I can really create that texture. The encaustic paint can be created to be very transparent, or you can create it to be much more opaque. So I think about that as I'm creating layers too. Where do I want the opacity, and where do I want the transparency to, to meet, or you know, fight with each other? Do I want to create that sort of feeling in, within it or not? The original oldest encaustic art found is our masks. They were funerary masks. There are still paintings that exist from the times of the Greek and Egyptians. It's very stable and it's, you know, it's hard. It melts at about 180, 200 degrees. So if you're, it's in your house and it's melting, then you probably have a lot of other problems to worry about. I think Arts Walk is this amazing community event. It's a collaboration between local businesses and artists. I love being part of Splash Gallery. A lot of the artists are so supportive. It's an opportunity for people who have never expressed their creativity in public to express their creativity in public. So what advice would I give folks that have never done art before and want to explore art? And I would tell them to go for it. Don't purchase the most expensive art supplies because then you treat them as precious and you are afraid to explore and play with them. And that's the whole goal is to play with them. And so I was, it sounds kind of silly, but I really listen to my painting and the paints and it kind of tells me, I get a feeling that I know it's done. Hi, I'm Eileen Boxler and I'm the Fall 2024 Arts Walk cover artist. Come see me at Arts Walk. I will be at Splash Gallery with the cover piece. <laughs> I don't know why that is so I don't know why that's so hard to say, but it is.